Jeez, cool, right? I'm glad I got your attention. Glock versus Sig Sauer, which one do you like the best and which one is right for you? Glock is the most widely used handgun in the world. Pretty much every single military and law enforcement agencies out there, over 20 million delivered, and there's a reason for that. However, Six Hour is becoming that newcomer that's making some big noise out there with military contracts and doing other big things. Is that a Glock killer? That's what we're trying to find out. Hey everybody, Kai with Classic Firearms and we've got Aaron here with us. Hey guys. And today we're gonna talk about exactly just that. We've got multiple different Glocks over here in front of me and multiple different variations of Sig Sauer brand over here. So I'm gonna go straight right into it and talk about what we're gonna compare. We have the Sig Sauer P365. Let me show it to you. This little micro compact and it's gonna go against the Glock 43, just like that. And then, Iron sights, iron sights. Then we've got the 43X and P365 XL here. I know this is a Spectre comp, but we put the XL slide because you can do that with SIG. The red dot and light, so apples to apples. And good old, obviously, M18, which is issued to the Marines, and the Glock 19X. Now, the M18 has got a four inch slide, I mean, four inch barrel, so shorter compact slide, but full size uh, frame. That's why we didn't use a regular Glock 19. We used the Glock 19X because it's very comparable to the M18. And moving on to Glock 17, the OG started everything in 1982. And we've got the M17, that's Army's sidearm. Iron sights to iron sights. And moving on to Glock 34 with a Timney tr trigger, Timney Alpha trigger to make it fair because we got the uh, 6RP320 x5 or legion right x5 legion, legion right here and this is aaron's personal gun that's my favorite that's my baby so that's your baby okay oh, no. we're gonna test it against <laughs> the glock 34 and ryan i'm not too sure what's going on here what are these two uh so this is a p322 okay and a glock 44. all right like we got them both over here the 22 calibers i mean if you look at them they look just like full-size normal 9mm guns, but they're 22 caliber. Great for training and teaching people how to shoot guns, and they're fun yeah. to plank around, right? Shoot out lights too every now and then if you need Exactly, <laughs> shoot out lights too. <laughs> exactly. Well, were you in law enforcement or what? I was, I did a little bit of law enforcement in my day. I, I, I did. Yeah. Did I you tell? tell. <laughs> I could tell, dude. <laughs> so, yeah, anybody who doesn't know you, uh, Aaron is a new team member here, a good friend, absolutely a guy that knows, has done a few things. So you want to introduce yourself? Oh uh, yeah, Aaron Suzo. Um, I did law enforcement out in Hayward, California for about seven years now. Um, retired recently and now I have the opportunity to work with this great group of people here at Classic Farms and I look forward to it. That's awesome dude. Absolutely happy to have you here and I know this, uh, you've got some experience uh, of so guns on this side the six-sided table, side of the table okay. is what I have experience with. The Glock I haven't had too much. I mean we did have the option of Glock or SIG when I was working. Okay. But I went to the good side here, the light. Okay. Here, the dark side's there. I stayed on the light side. Ah, hey, you know what? <laughs> Today we're gonna have a little competition between me and you. So you're the SIG guy, and everybody knows if you guys don't, I am the Glock guy. All right, guys, we have to cut. Sorry about that, because the C130 just flew pretty low. I don't know what's going on, but going back to the video. So <laughs> I'm, I'm not a Glock fanboy. I just like them because that. That's really what I was issued in law enforcement. Right. And I'm pretty well versed with Glock, so I like them. Hey, you know what, they work. It's not everybody's cup of tea, but today we're gonna have some, some fun with it. And quick Glock's history for you. In 1982, Gas and Glock just submitted a Glock 17, the Gen 1 to Austrian military for to have their contract. Yep. Dominated the field and got 25,000 delivered and then the word spread like wildfire and now Glock is where it's at today. And that's, you know, it's it's just been working. That's why Glock really made very minor improvements over the years. But SIG, I gotta give it to you, man. They're doing some really, really big things. And they I'm very that. open to actually try them out. And Yeah, they changed the game a little bit with the modularity. That's the biggest thing that yeah. I, I find the pro of the SIG is the modularity. Yeah, I agree. And the, the really good, I'm open to kind of, obviously having, uh, using them more, so. 
Anyways, enough talking. What do you think? Should we just start I'm shooting? Ready. Let's go. All right, let's get to shooting and see which one is gonna win today. All right, I've got the Glock 43 in my hand and Aaron has got the P365. And what we're gonna do is just like we did at the Glock versus Canik video, me and Clint did. If you haven't seen that video, go check it out. You're probably gonna like that. Actually, the reason we're doing this video is because you guys asked for a Glock versus Sig video, so here we are. Anyways, it's gonna be the same exact concept. Aaron, what I want you to do is, I want you to go ahead and shoot these two magazines at a target behind us, two of them about 15 yards-ish out there. Cool. And then hold your opinion, but I know you're a sick guy, but try to be as unbiased as possible. I can do that. And, you know, recoil management, all that stuff, put it all together, see which one you like better at the end, and you're gonna pick one, and then we're gonna move on to the next one. Okay. I'll do the same thing. Sounds good. Okay, so that's about it, but right off the gate, Glock 43 is gonna have a six round magazine capacity and P365 is going to have 10. Plus the one. Make now, one. plus one I get it, but 10, that's four rounds more and yet a very comparable in size. Now, Shield Arms out there is doing a great job actually making, turning this six into nine. So there is that three extra, but still, Glock definitely fell short on this one. Anyways, Aaron, you wanna do it? Yeah, let's get after it. Another thing I noticed is sights. Yes. Yeah. Sig P365 has got pretty good night sights, like the front side is that green dot and Glock. Unfortunately, guys, got this. Let me show you that way. Traditional good old Glock sights. And when you look at the prices, they're both in the 500s, uh, right in the 500s. So you guys probably can find them in the 400s nowadays, but MSRP wise, they're in the 500s. Anyways, ready? All right, let's get after it. All right. Start I'll start up with the, uh, the sick. Yeah. All right, go for it. Going hot. Go hot. Good shooting, dude. Okay, dry. Right there. Now that's your Glock. Go on up. Just six rounds? Yeah, full shoot. Right. I'll, hold, I'll hold my opinion. I'll okay, hold, hold your opinion. I'll hold my opinion. Now I'm gonna go ahead and quickly have a reload. We'll have a little cut and then I'll be back. All right, I'm up next with the SIG P365XL, about 15 yards out. Man, this gun is small. All right, let's see it. Nice. Okay. All right. Let's All see right. That Glock. Take that one as a Glock. Man. Okay. Take that. Okay, this is clear. Aaron, what did you think, man? Go ahead and All right. tell me your so thoughts on my sitting. opinion, honestly, just because I have a little bit bigger paws with all of them. Okay. With these two pistols, they're extreme. You can feel how small they are. Oh, so yeah. once you start getting into that shooting, it just felt like it was disappearing in my hand. That's for both of them. So I can't take away um, a point for either one on that one. I can't take away a point for either one. I still have to go with the SIG. Once I got my sights on the SIG, it's just easier to find those sights on the SIG, honestly. Um, the 10 rounds also, yeah, that's, that's a always big a good deal. feeling because when I got to the six, it's kind of like you're waiting for more. Yeah. So I've got to give it to SIG on this one, honestly. All right, your SIG's your pick. Guys, I'm going to go with SIG as well on this one because number one, capacity, it does absolutely matter. So SIG gave me 10 rounds plus one, 11 rounds. And believe it or not, I had a better recoil impulse with SIG than with uh, Glock. I mean, again, they're both micro compacts, so they're gonna have some kick, right? right? But I felt like Glock was a little bit more snappy. Per, and on top of that, better sights on the SIG for sure. Right. And comparing these two, I mean, this is not cut for a dot. That is overall SIG, like by far, yeah, for I sure. I agree with you. So let's move on to the next one. All right, I've got the 43X, Glock 43X in my hand here with an RMSC shield, red dot, TLR7 sub, light and we deck the uh, 6P365XL exactly the same way to make it ex basically apples to apples comparison. And that's it. Now what you see here, as I told you before, Spectra Comp body here, but to make it more fair, we remove the comp, we put an actual 365 
XL slide on it, so it's pretty, pretty close, okay. right? Pretty close. All right, you want to do the same thing? Yeah, let's do the same All thing. Right, go I'll for it. Oh, I want to say this though, uh, capacity. Guys, 10 rounds for the Glock 43X and 12 for the uh, P365XL. Getting closer. Getting However, closer. yeah, it is getting closer, exactly. However, Shield Arms actually makes 15 round magazine for Glock 43X. Nice. So, there's that. Take it for what it's worth. Go for it. Let's make it up. Have at it. 15 yards. Alright, going hot. Left. So you had three hits on there and they're just spot on. Perfect. Great grouping. But you're going to the left. Um, you know what that is. Oh, you so the dot is, do you think dot is No, up? it's not the dot. You can teach exactly what it is. So I have a tendency, I know exactly what I'm doing. Okay. I have a tendency of crushing my gun. Gotcha. Oh, you, hence my bigger gun. <laughs> you're a big guy. It is. It is what it is. And that's exactly what I'm doing for correction purposes. I crush my gun so it's going to take my shot left. That's why you kept saying left. Okay. And I already knew what I was doing when it came to that. That's hence why I bought it back a little bit. So okay. that's me crushing my gun. Well, let's see how you do with this one. All, All right. right. There's 10 see. rounds in there. All right. All right. That's the Glock. Keep going, keep going, dude. Nice. You know what? You broke that target. That is right on there. Nice. All right. All right, so I'm going to go for it, and then I'll give you my opinion. Feel free. And I'll go to the target to, to the left. Fix that target on the left there. Okay? Yeah. I'll be back. Make it happen. All right, so it's my turn, and you said the sights are off on this one. A little bit. Okay. A little bit. To be, to be fair here, I'm not going to change anything. So let's see how bad this is, and I'm going to start with the Glock first. So, was that a hit? Looks like a hit. You hit you, missing left. Dude, you were not kidding. Yeah. I, I literally was aiming off the target to the right. And I was kind of hitting it. And when you look at this thing, it, it looks Bottom like it left. should be on. When I bring the dot to the front side, it's dead center. So, all right. Well. All right. There she is. Going. So we got the P365XL. All right, so let's go for it. So I think I need to go down low. This is uh, yeah, the sights are off shooting low a little bit. Okay, fine. Hmm, what do you think? So yeah, Glock first. Glock. I mean, I was kind of focused on me being off with the sights, but I mean, I like the grip on it. The kick, I think, is comparable to the Spectra. Okay. What I, I have to go with the Sig again, and I mean, it sucks to say this, but the Spectra trigger definitely feels better. Yeah. If I am going iron sights on this, I was following up with those iron sights on there also. Um, so I, I got to go with the Sig on this one too. Honestly, it has. If I felt like it had a little bit more grip to it when I was grabbing it, yeah, I had a little bit try more. Again. I, I'm gonna cast my vote on this. All right, right off the gate, I'll tell you this. I really do like the way Glock feels in my hand. Like it feels better in my hand. Okay. Than Sig, it's just a little bit smaller for me. Right. The the, the size is just right for my hand. It's really good for a compact gun, right, or subcompact gun. However, I really don't like the traditional Glock sight, so I got to give that to Spectre Comp. The trigger, absolutely, well, I don't want to say Spectre Comp, I want to say P365, but they're pretty similar, honestly, you know, uh, when it comes to triggers. So definitely trigger sights for SIG, ergonomics, kind of the way it feels in my hand, Glock, capacity, obviously SIG. I feel like the recoil mitigation also is similar. Very similar, yeah, recoil was very similar. It's a toss up for me, I think I'm gonna go with SIG because of the capacity and the sights. So. Sig definitely takes it, but pretty close second Glock 43X. I gotta agree. Yeah? Yeah. All right, let's move on to the next. All right, now we're starting to get to some serious business here with the Glock 19X in my hand and the P320 line. This is the M18, the one that's issued to the Marines. Correct. In Aaron's hand. So we're gonna compare those two. 
And right off the gate, when I look at it, obviously this has got the extended magazine. We got the uh, non-extended one right here. Okay. 17 round magazine capacity. What's yours? 17. So 17, 17. Yeah, we're getting on the same price here. And right off, yeah, I know yours is cut for a dot, it but is? that's proprietary to SIG dots. That's correct. And you do lose that rear sight. Correct. And the 19X isn't, but Glock 45, which is the exact the same gun, guys, but it's just not FD, it's black. It is got the MOS versions and it comes with numerous different adapter plates so you can pretty much throw any red dot that you like on top of that gun. So definitely Glock has the upper hand on that one. And 19X has the uh, good old night size because this was submitted for the Army's uh, <laughs> sidearm competition or trial. Didn't make it, but anyways, it's right here. And I'll point out too, one thing I could see already is the safety. External safety, do you like it or not? I don't like the external safety. I'm not Why not? I'm not a fan of external safeties. I like that one fluid motion, we're drawing out and I'm getting involved. Same here, dude. So. It's just so funny. I can tell you, you used to be a cop. Uh, yeah, it happened. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> dude, I don't like the external safety and anybody who's asking why, like, of course, that's another extra point, but I really don't like, because when I draw it, I can inadvertently activate it. Correct. Like that, so you draw it, get, let me see your hands, and you press that trigger, you nothing happens. You right. get that dead man's dead man. gun. And also, you keep it open, like on, on your gun, in your holster, when you draw it, if you're not really trained or some, you're really stressed, you may forget to deactivate it. Right. And that gives you that dead man's gun. It's just not for me, but I totally understand it has a market share. Dead. Right, so there's that. Anyways, without further ado, you wanna go ahead and start with yeah, that? Yeah, I guess start it up. All right, All right. same 15 yards. All right. Feel a little bit more comfortable. You, you're a SIG user. Okay, I get it. I get it. Let's see that bad boy. Now, I want to see you do the same thing with this guy. Let's see what I can do. <laughs> okay. Fine. Fine. You missed more with that. So, can I get a SIG mag from you? Yes, sir. You can do that. All right, so with that being said, Give you that. keep the block for me, please. Let's see if I can do this. All right. All right, sight's not bad. Did I miss the last, what, five? Something like that. All right. You got a mag on you for the block, correct? Okay. Come on, Glock. Take a mag out of your gut. Yeah, yeah. Come on, Glock. Make me proud, please. All right. It's just me and those last way. few rounds, right? Last few. All right. You know what? Speak on it. Let's go ahead and say it. Put it away. There you go. Go ahead. <laughs> Come on, Glock! Okay. Well, I think we're gonna go ahead and do it again here. All right. Well, nothing can, changed. There you can, go. Can I get a mag from you for a sec? You want one more? You got one? Just to see what's going on. <laughs> just, right. just, just one more. Empty one. If not, Sig loses. Yeah. Come on. Wait, wait, wait. There oh. she is. All right. Let it take you Let's to see. the promised land. Don't worry about it. <laughs> All right. You ready to tell the camera what happened just now? Okay. Yeah. How, how accurate was I with this thing? I would think you were more accurate with the SIG. You look like you felt better with the SIG, honestly. Hmm. Right off the get, I'm going to tell you, I don't like this curved trigger. <laughs> what do you think? I don't like the curved trigger, but if we're doing comparisons, I prefer. All right, let's start with the sights. What do we got here? Okay, Glock 43X, but you know, let's just say 45 too, because it's a lot of people are gonna get that. Okay. Sights, Glock gives you that. The base sights, I don't like it. So sights, I'm gonna take six sights. Okay, I'll so there's that. that. I don't like that you have to throw six proprietary 
red dot on it. Okay, yeah. we don't have a red dot there, so we can throw that out for now. Just, just saying, it's an no. option, right? Okay. okay, fine, fine. You got a good point. <laughs> External safety, nope. I agree with you on that. Give it to Glock. Magazine capacity is a toss up. I just, I like the grip angle on this gun. I just don't like that it's kind of fat. Well, you could change that. Hence you can change the, mod the body? The modularity of it. Okay. Something a little bit slimmer, I think I'd be very okay. happy with So if it. you take a look at the back here, see it says yeah. the M right there? You go small, medium, or large. Grip on that. Okay, so you there you go. Change this is the medium out. right here. So I can go smaller, it will be a little slimmer. Correct. Because I understand the magazine has to fit, so you can't really go too slim, but Correct. it's a little bit fat. I feel like there's some real estate there. So you then know? you could actually slim that down a little bit if that's the case. Okay. Solved your problem there. So what else you got? Yeah. And trigger wise, I mean, I, I'm just not a fan. Okay. Just not a fan of this. Maybe because I'm really used to the Glock uh, trigger, right? It's understandable. But, uh, I think a very small, very little small margin, I'd go with the Glock on this one. Yeah? Yeah. Glock for me. Glock for you? All right, I've got to go with the SIG. I just don't like the shape, the, the way it feels in my hand, honestly. And again, okay. that's, not, that's, I guess you call it maybe favoritism of being biased with using SIG all yeah, the time. Yeah, yeah. I still, the, the shape in my hand, it feels a little bit different. Well, how close is that 19X to this? Shooting wise, in reference to um, recoil, and compatibility, everything, I mean, I think it's almost even when it comes it's to that. Exactly. I mean, when we started picking up the pace a little bit, uh, recoil yeah. mitigation is about the same with that. So I have to give it a toss up on that one. Um, the trigger, I as much as I don't like that, and we just finished shooting the flat trigger, yeah. I still have to go with the Glock on that. I agree with you on the safety. Glock or SIG? I mean, I'm sorry, SIG. Okay. Um, I agree with you on the safety aspect yeah. of things. If we were to put a red dot, I do agree with you. The fact that it can only put a, a yeah, red dot on it, that yeah. does suck a little bit, but. I think this was the military's, rec uh, I guess, requirement to have this external safety. But hey, you were way more accurate with this. Like you shot it real fast and you were pretty much out, out of like two or three misses. That that was it. Yeah, you, I felt you were more pretty good. With that one. So, okay, sounds good. Yeah, I'm going to SIG. Let's move. All right, uh, Glock for me. So in this case, we got three SIGs for you in a row. Correct. And I got two SIG, one Glock. Moving on to the Glock 17 and... It's about to get faster. Yeah, okay, <laughs> moving on. All right, now I got the Glock 17, you got the M17. M17, 320. Okay, so there's something special about this. When you were a police officer, you carried the good old regular 320, so pretty Precise. much this gun. Correct. The only difference was with the M17, as you guys know, it's gonna be the same lower as your um, M18 that we shot before, um, but it'll, on the P320, the full size, it'll have the actual full size polymer lower. And what about the external safety? External safety is a no-go on that one. Okay, so folks actually have the option to have the M17, M18 with the external safety or just a good old regular three, P320 with no external safety. Correct. Pretty cool, so you carried that, so you're very well versed and experienced with that exact gun platform, right? I've got a little, bit of, a little bit of time. All bit. right, the reason it's special because, and this is what I carried, mm. the Glock 17. Oh boy, I think we should have a little competition with these two. It sounds like we're about to do it. All right, let's just start with the good old stuff. Okay. You just shoot these two, All and right. I'll do the same thing, and then maybe I'll think of something. I wait. Let's do it. Let's do it. Not making that. Dude, really good shooting. Really good shooting. You just had, Here's I think like two. those three just went above because they weren't hitting the berm, but pretty good, man. Awesome. All right. Let's see what this Glock is all about. Come on, Glock, represent. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Purposely <laughs> close this. <laughs> Now, okay, I, I don't blame you. Okay, guys, I'm, I'm experienced with Glock 17, but not with these stupid sights, okay? I don't like these sights. These are just basic sights. I've always had the good old night sights, and my last uh, duty, I had the Ameriglow, Ameriglow sights. Love them. These... Yeah, they're not the they're, they're most just, fun to get back on. But. Yeah, it does make a difference, but I'll start with the... With the Glock? No, uh, you know what? I'll start with the SIG. With the SIG? That's the way you do. All right. All right, so. Represent, Sig. 
Represent. Show him what he should have been doing his yeah. whole life. Hundred percent, my friend. I hope. Is you this don't a Glock? What? Oh, you thought that was a Glock, right? Damn it. Okay. Sick for the win. We just wrap this up right now. Save everybody oh. some time. All right, so. Cut this video short. Let's tell them what happened. <laughs> All right. So what happened was I missed a little bit more. Well, I didn't miss what say yeah. at all. At all. But I mean, sights. Okay. I mean, I don't want to make excuses, but sights it definitely helps. make a difference, right? Um, okay. You know what? Let's just not this because this is so special for me, right? Clock 17. I can't just write it off like that. Okay. Let's just do a little competition. What we should we? Uh, let's just shoot on the uh, shot timer. Okay. Okay, let's do that. So I'm gonna start. Just see how fast we mag dump. Mag dump accurately, and we'll count our hits. Okay. Is that good? That sounds good to me. All right, let's do that. I got one for you. So you too. got a mag. Yeah, I got one. Yep, got an extra one for you. Perfect. We'll that. Got the shot timer here. This is a loaded mag right here. And there you go. If you can load that up. All right. So let's go. Do you want to go to this target? Yeah. Because that's kind of not uh, yeah. still painted. All right, good. So we're looking at about 15 yards, right? This one's about 15. Maybe 20 yards About between that. that. Okay. So on the beep, there's 17 rounds in there. Just shoot them. We'll just look at the time and how many misses. Drop it up. All right. Shoot it ready. Shoot it ready. Yep. I was not expecting that. Oh, holy cow, all right, all right, good. Good stuff, I'll, I'll, I'll try to do the same thing. That was just a dump. <laughs> so four, four seconds, I really thought you were gonna shoot fast, but you were gonna, that was good. All right, so. We'll talk about it later. Two hits? No, uh, three hits. Three, we'll go three. Yeah, three hits, so in four seconds. All right, let's see what we can. <laughs> all right. So you got the shot timer. <laughs> Let me get on this target first. All right. All right. Ready? Yep. You ready? Ready. Stand by. Four point one six. I think you had five. Did I count that right? About five. All right. Well, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, seven. oh come on! I had more than that. All right, seven and so, four point one six. Four point one. All right, let's do that. So it was about the same. So you had 4.08 and 4.16. So I'm a little bit slower, tiny a little bit. All right. We'll see okay, let's does. do that with the Glock. All right, let's All start right. with the Glock. So put that, you know, we'll just put it over here somewhere. I'll try to move here. How about that? Okay, sounds good. So I've got the Glock mag here and the Glock right here. There you go. You can just set it forward. All right. All right. All righty. Shooter ready. Get on that. Target. On it. Okay. Shoot ready. Yes, sir. On the beat. That was a solid seven hit. Yeah, that triggered. I did not like that trigger, buddy. Yeah. 456, 456 right here. And that was about, I'd say, six, seven hits. I couldn't really count. I'm sure the comment section's going to let us know. And I guess I'll do that. All right. All right. You got that mag for me? Oh, all right. <laughs> all right, so we'll load a mag and we'll be right back. All right, it's my turn, 17 rounds. All right. Glock 17. All right. Hold on. Shoot Let me get ready. on this target. Let me get on this target first. Shoot it ready? Okay, yep. Stand by. Three point seven. I believe I counted five. Is that what happened? I, I couldn't count. Counted about five. Five? Yeah. Okay. So I got three point seven with five hits. All right. So I think I was. So I had like about seven on the uh, sig. Correct. Right. And you had about seven on this one for sure. 
in my yeah, opinion. Three on the SIG, I think it was three gotcha. or four on the SIG. So clearly, I think you did better with the SIG and I did better with the Glock. Is that right? So. Say that. Right. Do you want to do one controlled or? I'd say let's control the cadence. Let's okay. See we go with that. All right, sounds good. Let's do that. All right, let's do that. Let's load up. Yep. All right, guys, just to show you how small these targets are. So yeah, we were mag dumping and still making five to seven hits on these targets from almost 20 yards. You guys see these? These are actually pretty small. If that was an actual person or full silhouette, obviously there'd be more hits. So I'm pretty happy with the way I'm good with that. No. So, and you want to spread the trauma also. Ex exactly. You spread don't keep it in the same hole. It's doing nothing for you there. Spread the trauma, hit everything in there. Absolutely, because you already gave trauma here. Why not give, there's nothing there anymore. Just move on to the next plate. Oh, the next plate. So what we want to do right now is a quick drill under shot timer. We'll fire five rounds from again, 15 yards out, okay. but then that'll be like 65 yards out. Cause it's gonna be one, two, three, four, fifth one goes to 65 yards. Transitioning, okay. Exactly, so like there's it. transitioning and distance under shot timer. Let's see if SIG does it better with Aaron or me or Glock. Okay, all, all right. right, sounds good. All right, shoot it ready? Yep. All right, take your time. You wanna make them count. Got it up. All right. On the beep. Nice. That 591. 591. Dude, right there, if that's not an example of slow as fast, fast what is that? You know, fast as smooth, or whatever. Smooth, smooth as fast, fast as. You know what I'm talking about. <laughs> We're going live. <laughs> We're going live. All right. All right, that's hot. So. All right. Yeah. Safety's so. on. There you go. All right, shooter ready. Yep. Stand by. Miss. 6.63 with a miss. You see that? Here's a great example, dude. I, I sped up right here, yeah. but still, you know what? It was still slower than you, and I missed. Sounds Let's do it again right. with the Glock. With the right. Glock. So, there's a the Glock right All here, right. and the holsters went up. Do a mag for me? Uh, yes, Go right here. All right. Can't promise the same results on this one. It's the shooter error, man. It's not the gun. <laughs> it's not the gun. <laughs> All, right. All right. Shooter ready? Yes, sir. On the beat. So 553 right here, I mean, this 553. Right. So you had only two hits out of five. Yeah, so, okay. all right. Yeah, I think it's a gun. <laughs> okay. <laughs> there you go, it's uneven. All right. All right. Yep. Shooter ready? Ready. Stand by. Eight point six six, and what'd you have? Four. Four yeah. total hits. So I had one miss. One miss on that second shot. Yeah. So what do you think? I don't know. I mean, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I do not like the sights. Like 17 is my gun. So it, it is my gun, and I know how capable this gun is, and how well I shoot it when it's set up properly. Yeah. Right. And it honestly, it's the sights. Sight, sights. 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 It's loaded. And one in the chamber and everything, okay? So I would say a very, very sh slim margin. I'm giving it to this guy, Glock 17, okay. because I can't betray my guy. Opposite to you, I can't betray this guy. It showed exactly what happened there. The sights definitely help out a lot, especially yeah. when you come to that last transition, that yeah. shot. And I'm actually surprised I missed that, that one. And I hit it with this. You made it with that, look more comfortable there. Yeah. So. Oh. I've got to give it to the SIG, but good All competition. Right. I like it. Yeah, dude. So four SIGs for you. Four for me. And two and two for me. Yep. Now let's bring it to the big boys. Let's do it. All right. All right. This is the last battle. All right. SIG versus Glock. In this case, I've got the Glock 34 with this uh, Timney Alpha trigger here. Nice. You know anything about it? No, please. Before. Dude, it is fantastic. I think you're going to like it. All right. With a obviously red dot loophole Delta Point Pro here. And that's it. This is it. 
However, we've got something special here. You do. Your personal gun, so yes. tell us about it. Sig P320 X5 Legion. Um, I've got the hollow sun, I believe it's the 508 hollow sun. Okay. Um, it's got the flared magwell, flat um, trigger, and this all comes stocked the way it is besides the trigger. I mean the um, the red dot on this. I mean, I love this thing. Feel the weight on that. It's just such a balanced feel to me. Oh, yeah. I mean, it's a looker, too. Yeah. And look at this accelerator pad right here. Oh, yeah, I forgot about that. You ready to race or what? Oh, I'm down. Boom. Okay. So, well, this is going to be... There's no way. I mean, I could just say right off the gate. There's no way you're going to pick the Glock over this. No, you can't. Just based off looks alone, I'm picking this. Right, the video's done, then. Let's yeah, go home. Let's go wrap it up. Until then, let's shoot. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's do the same thing, because I don't actually shoot that thing. Uh, I'm still going to be honest. All right. I want you, you know. to be honest. All right, yeah, I'm sure. <laughs> Let's do it. Same thing. Dump those. Uh, what was that? 17 rounds? No, we got a 21 rounder on this one. All right, go for it. Extend it out a little bit more. I'm gonna use the extended one over here. All right. And that. That was a hundred percent, dude. She's a looker. Okay. He's a looker. I can do I, the same. Well, you're gonna shoot the Glock next. It's it's uh, you gotta shoot load up. it up. Yeah. I'll, I'll okay. Yeah. All right, so that was really good shooting, man. Really good. All right. All right. There we go. Let's see it. Dude, you had two very like narrow misses, man. You were. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna hold back what I'm gonna say in a second. I was gonna say something, and it's gonna don't, be good about the Glock, but I'm not gonna say it yet. Okay, because you shot that thing faster. I'll tell you why in a second. Just, just I felt something. Something felt good on the Glock. What? I, okay. Let's continue. <laughs> All right. First time shooting this bad boy. All right. That last one, holy crap! Uh, can't say anything. Uh, give me the Glock. Need a mag on that one. I got it. All right, so let's see. Tim the Alpha one. I think we're about the same. Same. I think I was. Let's, have, let's have this conversation. I'm excited to actually say this, and it's going to help you out a little bit with the Glock. Uh, that trigger surprised the hell out of me. That's, dude, I That's, said it too. That trigger definitely surprised you think, a lot of me. You think there's still some room to go? Yes. Boom, it breaks. I do like that trigger a lot. Yeah. 100%. I'm still going with my bad boy here, but I will give Take more points. Take it easy. Let's compare some points. Don't jump the gun yet. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. What do you got? What about, okay, uh, what about the ergonomics? Ergonomically, I still got to go with my X5, but I will give props where they are due. That felt good in my hand. It felt good in my hand. The follow-up shots were fast. I knew it was coming. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Take, do it again. Yeah, you hold that. All Let's right. do it again. I'm going to speed this one up. Hold on, up, so hold on. You're gonna, not going to speed that up. Gonna speed this it's going to be on time. <laughs> All right. Uh, just do the same thing what you did. Don't go crazy on me. All right. Because hits, hits matter, right? That's what they say. Every time you miss, five second penalty. How about that? Oh, OK. All right. See, on, on the beep. Shooter ready? Yes, sir. Eight misses. Eight misses. All right, so you see do the same thing with your gun. Right, and that was six, seven, three, by the way. So uh, six, seven, three, last one with the block. Now uh, let's see with this one. Shoot ready. Yes, sir. On the beat. You had a few misses. I did. All right. Okay, so the time on that one. This was 1067. So, sir, uh, I regret to inform you, we're better with the Glock. No, okay, that. so it's my turn now. I got some mags here. You want to have the shot timer? All right, where we got? Shot there there we go. Right shot here. Timer. All right. You know, that's shot up, but okay. 
Maybe I'll shoot the other. No, I'll, I'll shoot the other target. Ah, you know what? I don't want any excuses later on. <laughs> okay. All you both. All, All right, shooter ready? Ready. Stand by. Seven, five, nine. Was that two misses? I don't know how many I missed. I think it was two, two misses. Two misses? Okay. You know what, Aaron? That's right. You all right? Good. Okay. I think I'm done. I'm not going to shoot yours again. Really? Why not? Because I made my mind up. Okay. So you going with this? Uh, no. Glock oh. 34. Wow. By a small margin, but I got to say this. Okay. With the Timney Alpha trigger. Without it, absolutely the Legion, right? Okay. Is that five Legion or Legion five? Uh, X5. X5 Legion. Okay. X5 Legion. Without that trigger, absolutely that one. But okay. I thought I was more comfortable with it. I was a little bit faster when it comes to accuracy. What do you think? Uh, about similar? Same, similar. So, okay. just felt more natural for me. You got it, okay. But it's a like a 50.1 lead, okay? Like the presidential election just recently. Something like that. Something like that. All right. Not really, but okay. But anyway, so <laughs> very close, but I, I gotta respect uh, that gun. All it's right. really phenomenal. I love that thing, but. Well, this guy, what do you think? Respectfully. I'll put that in my face again, please. You, <laughs> wait, you know, I this is the epitome of a fanboy right here. Call it what you want. I'm a fanboy and here's my boy. All right. Wait, okay, that's your boy. You Did you pick Glock at all? I didn't actually. I didn't. I got close. I won't lie. I got close. With this one? I did get close with that one. That was about it, honestly. Okay, fine. Right. So, but, so you picked. I got to go with the X5. Five SIGs. Five SIGs. You know what, I was actually nice to you, I picked two. Well, you know what, you're not doing this for me. I'm doing this for you, I'm trying to put you in a better place. <laughs> okay. Make them a better decision there. All right. But no, I had to, I definitely had to go with the X5 Legion, and that was close. Again, with the trigger, like yeah. I explained before, it was definitely a smooth shot, and yeah. I mean, it was pretty comparable. With, yeah. I mean, OBS aside. No, in all honesty, the, uh, SIGs are, man, I, I, I'm gonna admit for the first time, I, I think I'm starting to like SIG handguns a lot more, because I haven't been a fan. Okay. Not that because they didn't work, it just wasn't my style, but I'm starting to like them a lot more. Gotcha. This video was very helpful for me too. I hope it was helpful for you guys. I think we should do one more thing though, no? Oh, that's right. We got to do the 22 caliber ones. Let's try those. Let's do it. All right. So. I don't know if you see which one he's holding first. Subcon it's called a subconscious. Subconscious. Uh, subconsciously. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to know, because after I shoot, because I'm going to grab the Glock, I have to throw the gun that I shoot first away. That's why I grabbed this one first. He'll come back. Okay. Come back. <laughs> All right, so this is 22 caliber. Okay. All right, so it's empty good to go. You want to start first? Uh, yeah, you might as okay. well go. So you got Actually, the Glock. No, let's change it up. Change it up a little bit? Up. All right, where's my start mag? Off. Start off with the Glock. Oh, right off the gate. The slide kind of goes by itself, dude. All right. I saw that. I didn't do it. We can make things up if you want. It is what it is. <laughs> okay. There you go. Where's start the mag for that? that? All right, so Good, man. it's a Glock. Same thing. All right. Oh yeah, feels like home. Was that a miss? Ah, uh, it looked like a hit. No. A little, oh, okay, it's good. A, it's I can waving. It's like no way. All right. Did I count four misses? Somewhere Did I there. miss? Did yeah. I miss any? It was four misses. Are you serious? Uh, I think there was four misses there. Here's what I need. It, it didn't feel like there was any misses. Yeah, just take your time a little bit with this one. Let's Sig take no, you I'm home. I'm shoot it just as fast. Let's Sig take you home. Let's go ahead. All right. All right. So. Oh, Sig, come on. Can you you just were right on, too. You weren't missing anything. Can you please feed it properly, Sig? Yeah. That's the mag, it's not the gun. Well, yeah. Always, always. Let me do a little hand load if I can. There we go. Nope, I couldn't do it. Right away. Have to dump that uh, one out. Yeah. Let's, there we go. Good. All right. So you purposely missed two. I watched it. Perfect. Purposely. Purposely. Okay. All right. Well, um, I think you should tell people what you think about the SIG right now. Uh, well, that's what I think. You're right. I can't. He, I can't 
taint his thoughts because he's already made his decision about SIG <laughs> before he made this video. So All right, let me just shoot the thing and we'll get it over. <laughs> okay, there Let's you get go. Out the way. All right, go. I'll start off with the Glock. The One thing I can promise you with Glock, it's not gonna jam or it's gonna, not gonna give you any issues. We shall see. All right, let's go. <laughs> All right. There's a red thing over there. It's a target. Yeah. Oh, you, did you not see the target? I must have missed that whole target thing. Well, where's the Wait, do we have another Mac for this? All right, so. Same thing. Oh, wait, 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 what happened? Yeah. Didn't feed. All right, we're back in it. I feel like I didn't miss, though. Did you get, yeah. that, on, did you get that on camera? Pretty good, Pretty good. okay. Yeah, you like, missed. I feel like the SIG. Dude, what the heck? I I'm, like I'm the serious. Sig. I'm not even joking right now. How the heck did you miss so many with this thing? I, I'm telling you, I just felt so much better with the SIG, honestly. And it just shows. It was a little fix you had to make, and things happen. We fix things. In gunfights, they happen also. So. Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll be honest. SIG clearly won this one. Yeah. Now, because right off the gate, like, grab this thing. Okay, it's a Glock, right? Uh, you know, hold this. Dude, as soon as I grab this thing, when it comes to ergonomics, this thing yeah. feels amazing. It does. It just feels perfect in the hand, better sights. And it lines up smooth, too. Yeah. Everything it, is just in the straight yeah. line. Yeah, it better sights and better ergonomics. I like that. I just don't like that slide. It happened a couple of times, kind of went on its own. And the whole, that could be an ammo issue, it could be a magazine yeah. issue. But overall, yeah, without a doubt, the SIG yeah. was a clear winner for me. So with that being said, I think I picked more SIG than Glocks. I believe so. I believe. No? It wasn't more than that? How many, how many? Okay, I, I picked three the- Three and three. Uh, oh, it was three and three. Three and three, that's yes, right. Was. Okay. Because that last one you did. Okay, you did hey, the everybody knows me as a Glock guy, for the most part, right? Mm. And the fact that I actually picked three SIGs, and I'm not a SIG guy, that just says a lot about SIG. We're influencing. That's right. It's coming this way. Yeah. Come on so, over. So is it a Glock killer? I guess that's what we try to find out here. Yeah. I wouldn't say that just yet, but I could see that SIG is going to continue to do some big things, man. Yeah. Um, I wouldn't say it's a Glock killer, but I think they're definitely comparable. They are Did definitely you know? getting up there. So, yeah. wow. I'm Seriously, guys, this video legitimately changed my mind about SIG. I'm glad we did that. So I'm going to try to give SIG more chances. And I will also say... It changed my mind about Glock a little bit too. Really? Yeah, I, I definitely would give Glock a chance. Maybe put one in the safe. Did, did we just become best friends? I wouldn't say all that, but we're, we can shoot together if you want. <sighs> Damn, <laughs> that hurts. All right, we can be friends. <laughs> okay, so uh, no, this is really, really, this was really good. All right, what do you guys think? What, do you, what, what kind of a fanboy or gal are you? Clocks, six, do you have both? What are your opinions? Let us know in the comment section. And thanks for tuning in. I hope this video was helpful to you guys because I legitimately learned stuff in this video as I was making it for you guys. So uh, anyways, appreciate you guys tuning in. Check out cfcontest.com. As I always say, the veterans of classic firearms know exactly what I'm talking about. If you go to, if you go to cfcontest.com, you're going to see things that you like. I guarantee it. All right, so check it out. Um, do you have anything to add? No, thanks for having me, guys. Enjoy. Absolutely. It was a pleasure having you, and we'll have you more because you're here with us, and you're stuck with us. I can't wait. All right, can't good wait. stuff. Anyways, thanks for tuning in. We appreciate your business. God bless. God bless. Stay ready. And we'll see you on the next one. <laughs>